Hi, I'm Scott Haskins, the author of How to Save Your Stuff from a Disaster. And today I visited a house, a really great house, about 9,000 square feet, with all the bling. I mean, it was just really a gorgeous place with lots of fun and uh, lots of beautiful things. But, you know, with all the beautiful things they had, the subject turned to earthquake proofing and uh, making sure that the house was safe for everyone when and uh, and when is the question, it's not if, uh, an earthquake hits. You know, it got me thinking also about my house and uh, I've got these bookcases in my office that I haven't strapped down yet. These are coming over for sure and uh, I'm hoping that I'm not sitting below them and of course my wife is hoping that the dogs aren't sitting below them when they decide to topple over. I'm not completely guilty of uh, not walking my talk. Uh, this hutch is anchored down and all the items inside are anchored down with museum wax. And just to prove it, there it is. Straps that will hold this to the wall when things start to shake. All these uh, cute family photos in these metal frames are probably going to be airborne. And uh, so I also want to keep my paintings on the wall and make sure that they don't come down. So I've got a little bit of work to do in my house too. And I hope this is a reminder for you that earthquake proofing your house, your office, is not only a matter of protecting what you have, in other words, the items, but it's also a matter of uh, protecting yourself, personal safety. There are a couple of uh, videos that are interesting uh, on YouTube. You can go to Preservation Coach and see a couple of uh, videos that uh, are about people who are talking about how they've um, used museum wax and anchor down their items. I think you'll find them interesting. Good luck and hope to see you soon.